Hello guys, so welcome to this YouTube channel. Today I want us to have a view of the system flowchart of Uzima Bora for whole drilling system. First of all, before you have a, a look at the system flowchart, I want us to see what are these symbols that we include in a system flowchart. So let us have a view of the following symbols. So we need to have the following symbols in our system flowchart. Just a minute. So you have the first one. So whenever you see this symbol, it represents the physical flow of goods. That symbol represents the physical flow of goods. Let's say in a company, when you want to take some goods to the store, so the symbols we use to represent that is that one. Then you have this other symbol. So this other symbol it represents a report. But in an, in <coughs> when you have multiple reports, we have another symbol. So this symbol here, this one here represents multiple reports. So when you want to generate multiple reports, we use this this symbol. Uh -huh. Then you have the other symbol. This is the disk master file. So you want to store all the files of your system, let's say in the Zimabora drilling system, you want to store all those files, we we'll use this symbol. Then you have this disk transaction file, you have that symbol. Then you have the tab file, you have uh, this arrow, this is just simply to represent direction. Then you have an offline file. Uh, so this represents an offline file. Then you have this symbol here. The rounded rectangle represents the start and stop. Uh -huh. Then you have the other one, the telecommunication link. Then you have the manual process. Whenever you want, whenever you want to input something manually, you use that symbol. Then you have the computerized process. So you use the rectangle to represent the computerized process. Then whenever you want to input data, let's say under the login have to input data this is the symbol so you use that symbol then whenever you want to show display when you want to show display you use that symbol here then when you want to connect when you want to connect a diagram from one page to another page you'll use this one ellipse is a non-page connector then you have the off page connector that symbol then you have the decision so I hope you are much aware about the decision. So after that, I want us to go to the deal of the day. This is the system flowchart of the Zimabora drilling system. It is here. So the system flowchart basically summarizes the whole logical process of the company. First of all, when you open our system, the database system, we have the start there. Then we require to log in. So we we'll log into our system. Then after logging to our system, the, sis the company offers various services. It offers the members registration. So first of all, we have the decision to ask the members is membership. If the person wants to, to access the membership service, they will be required to register. After they have registered, we'll have a decision because the company has different types of clients. We have the industrial clients, we have the commercial and the domestic. They tell us, is industrial, is client industrial? If yes, it calculates the survey and local authority fee. That is basically computerized process. That is why we have the rectangle. So it allocates the survey fees to 20,000 and local authority fees to 50,000. After that, if no, here we have a no. So if no, so here if no, just a minute. So if no, so if no have that one. So if 
no social portland no claim so if no we ask is clients commercial so if yes we draw a text box insert text box yeah let's do with yes